Good evening. Welcome to WJZ.com. We've had some snow showers, even a heavy snow squall around the Thermont area, Route 15 there near Sibyllisville and Thermont. That's moving down to the southeast. It's weakening. But if you're out on Route 70 or anywhere in Southern Carroll County, maybe western sections of Baltimore County, right along that line, you can see that stream of snow showers. Some of it in northern Frederick County and eastern sections of Washington County have been pretty heavy snow with the wind blowing, so some reduced visibilities. Roads are snow covered in a small area there in northern Frederick, eastern Washington County, and southern portions of Adams County, Pennsylvania. Now, just west of the city, right on I-70, you're heading out that way, you may run into some snow showers because temperatures have dropped. Anything that falls, although the ground's still pretty warm, you might see a minor little accumulation on the cars. Down to 33 now, 38 still in office, 30, 32. So temperatures are very conducive to these snow showers right now. Only 14 above zero in Oakland and still 36 in Salisbury, 37 down at the beach right now. The winds still a factor, 22, 17, 26. So you've got wind chills in the upper teens, the low to mid 20s around much of the region. Snow showers popping up. You can see a whole batch across New York State. And this streamer from Cleveland down toward Pittsburgh has reached all the way into central Maryland which is kind of rare. Usually the mountains just cut off this moisture, but this last little streamer made it into portions of north central Maryland. Although overnight tonight, most of this is going to dry up. Tomorrow we'll see a mix of clouds and sunshine. As we head to the end of the week, we'll have a kind of reinforcing shot of cold air on Thursday and Friday. So temperatures will be running below normal for a change. We haven't had that all year. Of course, the air is pretty new. But as we head into the weekend, the time moves off. Low pressure southwest of us means a good chance we'll see some snow Saturday night into Sunday. You can see the indications of precip. And that looks like it's going to be with us probably until maybe Sunday or early afternoon. By the, as you see, this model showing 9 o'clock beginning to clear up. So we'll deal with some snow, maybe a couple of inches as possible on Saturday night and into Sunday morning. Tonight then, breezy, colder, maybe some flurries, 25 to 30 overnight. Tomorrow, 39, a breezy, cold day with partly cloudy skies. 39 on Friday, down to 21, cold for the weekend. 33, snow late, snow ending on Sunday. Perhaps a couple of inches, maybe a few inches in a few spots, maybe south of us. 35, 42, warmer with more sunshine here for Tuesday and Wednesday. Updated forecast coming up late tonight.